got tomorrow. We've got three games this week. Yep. Yeah, we're excited excited to be back and be at home. Uh, disappointed in our first game with Bre with Bradley. If you told me before the game we'd score 92 points and make set a school tie a school record with 12 threes and uh, shoot 47 percent from the field and force 27 turnovers, I, I think I would have probably left pretty happy. But uh, give Bradley a lot of credit. They, they played extremely well. It was a really high level first basketball game, and uh, Bradley shot the ball extremely well. Obviously, we didn't dictate the way we need to defensively. Uh, the foul trouble hurt us. Uh, Alexis Smith being out, and then our starting point guard, Sarah Hartwell, picked up four fouls in her first you know, eight, ten minutes of play. Um, when she was on the floor, she scored 18 points in 22 minutes and, and shot eight for ten from the field, including a couple threes, so she was really good. Um, but So we got to keep her out of foul trouble. Uh, we'll get Alexis Smith back. Uh, we'll see. Um, we'll get more of a report tomorrow. She's going to see the doctor. Um, but excited to be back at home and decided to have a four game stretch here where uh, we'll get better defensively and uh, continue to grow. Was excited that Jackie Grant played really well in her first game, had 14 points, I think, and then 12 uh, or 14 rebounds and 12 points, including 10 offensive. So she sold uh, her and Sarah for you know their first time playing uh, college basketball. Sarah you know, didn't play much at Georgia Tech and then it set out. So those two in their first game, uh, I thought Amber was really good in the first half, hit six threes in the first half and seven for the game. And then Ivory showed that uh, she's definitely capable of scoring. We need those two to be really consistent this year. And then uh, hopefully we'll grow up fast. And uh, this is a great opportunity for us to play some games and continue to grow. And would love the community to come out. I know our season ticket uh, holders have a, uh, it's grown a great deal from when we came. There's 400 season tickets. And now there's 1,050 season ticket holders. And we need to keep growing, growing the program, growing attendance, and, and build great atmosphere in the State Farm Center. So we'll open up for questions. Given up 57 and a half? No, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't remember ever giving up 98. Um, it's the first time actually I've ever lost ever in uh, 12 years as head coach, ever lost my, the first game. Um, so, yeah, yeah, where it is a humbling kind of a, a helpless feeling for our coaching staff uh, on the floor, just not really knowing how to help them because we just didn't defend and didn't dictate and we just didn't, didn't control some things that we could control, which is disappointing. What, what kind of difference? Different defenses did you try to utilize? I assume that during the course of the game you tried different things. Yeah, we, we really play two defenses. We play the man and we play buzz, and we use both of them. Um, you know, looking back at it, uh, we started uh, didn't start as aggressively in the second half in the buzz, and I, I think I made a mistake there. You know, at the end of the first half, we made some changes, and it was effective, and we probably should have come out in the second half more aggressive uh, in that. Uh, the foul trouble hurt us, and um, we just weren't very aggressive, and we really got we got on our heels in the second half, start of the second half, and just never really got out of it. You know, give Bradley credit; they shot the ball extremely well, and we're really aggressive, and we just uh, couldn't ever seem to get a couple of stops together. Has Jackie kind of solidified a, start, a spot in the starting lineup, or is that kind of still? Yeah, I think it's you know the way she played that that certainly helps her chances. It was still even last week. We're going going into Friday, not knowing uh, who exactly her Sarah was going to earn that spot. Um, and so it's been really close throughout the fall, but Jackie certainly played really well in, in that game. I think Sarah is going to really be a difference maker for us as well, and, and uh, it's great to have some competition. You know, last year we really didn't have competition for starting spots, and it's great for those two to be battling, and when we get Alexis Smith back, that's going to add another piece. And, you know, Mackenzie Piper's had a really hard month with a uh, um, uh, concussion, and then she comes back, and her first day back she sprains her ankle. And so, um, you know, she's just not, not been very healthy, and hopefully we can get her healthy and, and she can get back to uh, possibly helping this team. Matt, if you look at the exhibition as well as the Bradley game, what's your, what's your uh, kind of uh, evaluation of, of, of rebounding? Because, you know, both times. Yeah, it's, it's been definitely been a, been a concern. We, we have not been good in the glass. Um, and we just we have to be better and we, we want to make the glass about a quickness and aggression and I don't think we've done that we haven't left the zone very well and we haven't really pursued the ball and uh, obviously we spent some time yesterday doing that and doing our war rebounding drill and I expect to see us be better tomorrow but uh, you know it's it definitely going to be an area that we have to focus on and we have to get better we need all five people to rebound um, you know we didn't have any of our, our players have over four defensive rebounds and you know, some of them played 37 to 40 minutes uh, you should get more than four defensive rebounds in that span. The other thing is we, they didn't miss a lot of shots, and they shot almost 60% from the field. we got to have more uh, missed shots, but then we've got to keep people from getting offensive rebounds. That hurt us in the second half. There was a few possessions. We got stops, and then they got offensive putbacks, and you could just see that kind of deflate our energy when that happens. Do you think the, the 
current makeup of your team, what, what, what kind of role do you foresee for them? Three-point shot, because obviously you were very effective with it a year ago. Might it be perhaps even more important with the, the current roster? Yeah, you know, I think it, we're going to have uh, hopefully have balance. Um, we shot it really well the other night. You know, charisma. Uh, not having maybe quite as dominant a five, but Jackie's uh, can really step out and shoot it. She didn't make any the other day, but in practice, she's been really consistent shooting it. And it's definitely something we want to use. It uh, is a great weapon for us. And when you make 12 threes, obviously it makes a huge, especially shooting 40 some percent from the three point line, it can be a really good weapon. You know, Amber can really shoot it. But we have a number of players that can score. We're talking about that. Coach Lewis and I were talking about that today. We've got a number of different players that can score. Where last year, especially at this time of year, we didn't have Adrian back yet. We were really, really pretty one dimensional. And so it's exciting to have a, a multiple players. Sarah Hartwell's going to be able to score, and Jackie, and obviously Amber and Ivory. Uh, when we get Alexis back, I think she's going to be able to score, and, and Taylor Tuck can get to the rim. So we've got more scores, and uh, that, that's going to make us a little bit harder. I think we're going to see a more balance out of this year's team than you saw last year's. All right, thank you.